Hey everybody, it's me Tartan Kawaii. Welcome to my new video. This video is all about tatas. I absolutely love these. These are the most adorable things ever. Okay, so what are these about? Well, this is actually to do with a game that you can download to your phone. It's done by Disney and it features all your Disney characters. Um, and basically it's like a little pop and kind of connect the characters together to gain points and coins and rubies. So basically go on Google and download the app is highly addictive and it's great fun. But that is not the point of my video. So today's video is a little bit serious because we're going to be talking about these really cute plushies that are from the Tum Tums game and Disney. So it, originally you couldn't buy these in the UK but this month Clinton Cards are going to be selling them and uh, which is quite exciting and soon after Disney are going to be selling them themselves too which is really really great so if you've been like me and been a fan already you would know that they're originally from Japan you could get them in the US you can buy them at the Disney parks um, I bought a lot of mine from Disneyland Paris so going back to the seriousness of my videos I love collecting things and mostly cute things everybody knows that and there is loads of collectors for these items However, I just wanted to make this video as more of a warning because there's a lot of fakes out there and I hope my video might help you avoid buying fakes because unfortunately I have been a victim to be getting a fake in the post so it kind of sucks. So I am going to show you the Tom Tom that I bought. Uh, I bought this off of eBay and it was actually from a UK seller so I was kind of like, oh it should be fine. Do not let that determine the fact that you think it's going to be a real Tom Tom because it's not um well this one wasn't in this case so I decided to buy Goofy um, I bought him in the UK and off of eBay and normally I'm really careful on eBay and you know really check everything out but um, I saw it and I was like yeah, yeah let's get Goofy so we got Goofy and here he is uh, just looking at him, you can tell that it looks like Goofy. Uh, he looks really cute and he looks like the others. Um, however, he is highly likely to be a fake Goofy. And I went on the internet and had a research. So I'm basically going to give you a couple of hints and tips and things to look for um, when buying these Tom Toms because I have discovered this one is very likely to be a fake or he could be a UFO catcher prize um, but yeah so here are some of my top tips on buying Tom Tums first off if the price is too good to be true don't touch it avoid it and find another Tom Tom the other piece of information I would give you is find someone on eBay like a trusted seller who's based in the US or based in Japan um, that you know that will prove to you that these are definitely the real Tom Toms. Another tip is check the images that they are using. Are they using stock images or are they genuine images that they've taken from their home and do they have any proof to show you that it really is the right thing that you're going to be buying. My last tip is buy from the Disney store to make sure you're buying the right item or another licensed place such as Clinton Cards who will be selling them from the 15th of February. How to tell if your Tom Tom's a real one or a fake one? Well, if you look at this one, he looks pretty, pretty normal for a Tom Tom. He's got everything in the right place. However, how do I know he's fake? The biggest giveaway is this. A chain. The real Tom Toms do not have any chains attached. There is also a rumor going around that sellers are chopping the chains off but you can normally find that there is a small indication of where the chain was. 
The other thing to look for in a fake. Features look off. I noticed that his eyes look a bit weird. I don't know if it was just me at first, but when I first looked at him I felt that one of the pupils, this one in particular, looks a lot bigger than the other one. The other thing to look for in a fake is the size. Now, looking at him just now, he looks kind of average for a normal tum tum. However, if you pick up a real tum tum, you will see that there is a big difference in size. You will also find that there is a different kind of feel to the tum tum. Now, this is something you can't check on such a place as like eBay. However, when you do receive it in the post, you'll soon tell. The real tum tums, you can feel the beads inside. The fake tum tums, there's more stuffing rather than beads. Quality. If you look at my fake tum tum, you will notice that Goofy's hat seems to have not been finished off properly in comparison to the real one. So this is my recap. Basically, a fake tum tum is most likely to have the chain. Some sellers are known for chopping the chains off, but you can find any evidence of that here on the loop. Look at the features on your plushie and you'll notice that one of his eyes looks a little bit off to the other eye. The other thing I notice on the fake Goofy is his hat. His hat seems to be unfinished, it's slightly not bothered to sew his hat up, hat together. And it also looks a bit different as well. So here's the real one. And this one's actually all the way from the Japan. Now as you can see, the sizes are totally different. The fabric is also different. Underneath the bellies, you will notice that it's more of a fluffy effect on the real one, but it's more of a smooth material on the fake one. And again, let's look at these hats. Now you can see that this one clearly is smaller, and it's also had the attention to detail as it's been sewn up. For the one on the fake one, nope, he's just been left, and he looks like he's got a really funny hat. The other thing about your tum-tums is the weight. These ones feel like they've got more beans in them, and that's your real one. These ones here, they're really, really soft, and there's only a couple of beads inside at the bottom, and you can actually feel them, um, and more feel more of the stuffing rather than the beads. Now, this is a Japanese tag, and this one claims to be a Japanese tag. However, you can see that they have different kind of tags, but don't let that put you off because I have some a variety of tags because mine have come from Disneyland and from America. So basically what you want to look for in the tags is you want a bright kind of coloured tag opposed to a tag that looks like it's been sitting in the sun for too long. So guys that was my hints and tips about fakes and the real ones. Um, please please be careful when you're online buying these. I know they are so adorable and they seem quite expensive. Um, some of the rarer ones are really expensive but they're totally worth it if you put the research behind buying these cuties. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with my fake one, it'll probably get used as a toy with my little one. Um, but yeah, I do collect them. I hope you guys start collecting them because they're so cute. They don't take up that much room, they're absolutely adorable. You can get them in small sizes, you can get them in the medium size. I don't have a big one yet but I'm looking forward to seeing if I can get a big Donald because Donald's my favorite and he's so cute. So guys, that was my video and um, I hope you like the video. I hope it helps you. Um, I just want to say if you can, please subscribe to my channel. That'd be fantastic. Give me some thumbs up. That'd be great if you really like my video. If you want to keep up with me, you can keep in touch on um, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Send me a chat. I'm happy to chat to you guys. And also, I do play the game as well. Um, so I'll leave my ID all in the description box so you guys can add me. And... Um, I really do hope that you start collecting these really cute tum-tums because they're so cute and adorable. Um, so yes, yeah, so if you have any questions as well about tum-tums or anything at all, leave some in the comments box because I love reading your comments. So until next time, bye bye!